Today, I'm going to teach you how you can make a smooth twixter in mobile phone, so, want this? So, this is the part 7th of beginner tutorial series, as I said before, in this tutorial I'll be teaching you about how you can make a smooth twixter just like After Effects, only using mobile phone apps, so, let's just start the tutorial. For the first step, use any app that doesn't lag on your device. I'm going to use CapCut, because that's the best editing app in my phone that doesn't lag. Now, add your clips and zoom in on the layer like this. After zooming in, cut each moving frame from your clip. I'm going to speed up this process, so that I don't waste your time. <laughs> Alright, after cutting every moving frame, click on Clips, and reduce the length of each clip to one frame. Oh, shit. Here we go again. <laughs> now, simply export the video and open Motion Ninja. Once you've opened the Motion Ninja app, select Smooth Slow Mo and add the, the video you've just export. Now, set the speed to zero and make sure that your settings is just like this. Once you've done that, proceed to export the video again. Okay, this process will take some time to render because it's removing the duplicate frames and the warping issues that happens in Twixter. Once the process is complete, export the video with the highest possible quality you can do in your device. Once the video gets export, click on this, More Edit. Afterward, select the video layer, go to Edit, then Speed. Enable Optical Flow and set the speed as you like. I recommend a speed between 5 to 6, I'm going to set it at 6. Alright, this process will take some time to render, so, I'm going to skip the video a little bit. Alright, your smooth twixter is finished without any warping. Now, export the video and do the time remapping as needed. And if you don't know how to do time remapping, I've already explained about that in the first part of the beginner series, so, you can just go and watch that video to learn time remapping. The tutorial is finished. I hope you understood everything clearly that I've explained in the video. If you did, then don't forget to like, share with your friends, and subscribe for more amazing tutorials. Until next time, take care and see you in the next video.